You know how editing can sometimes be a grind, right? I mean, it's it's fun when you're in the flow, but it can get tedious and time consuming. That's exactly why I've been diving into using AI to help with my editing. And honestly, it's a game changer. And this app I've been using, it's called Wondershare Filmora. Let me show you how it's been saving me hours of work and maybe some sanity too. First off, one of my favorite features, text to speech. Instead of setting up a microphone and recording it manually, I can just paste the text into Filmora, pick a voice, and enjoy the results in a few seconds. The voices available here all sound really natural and human-like, no weird AI artifacts. And what's especially cool is that the voiceover gets imported straight to the timeline. Each sentence has a separate track, makes it so easy to edit at all. What's even cooler is that I can just clone my own voice. The process here is super simple. Just record a consent, upload a few voice samples and wait. The voice clone in Filmora works really well. Right now, now you might not realize how useful text-to-speech is, but it saves me so much time, literally hours. And it actually works in a very clever way. As you know, we give AI only the written text, and if we're cloning our voice, the recording of the said voice. The system breaks down the written text into things like grammar, punctuation, and even sentence structure after which looks into its database for each such case and decides how to pronounce every word separately or in sentences. All sound in the system consists of phonemes united into map, which explains the punctuation to the AI. And then based on this map and the decoding of the text, AI creates a new sound like piecing together Lego pieces. And that's just one trick Filmora's good up its sleeve. It's also a beast when it comes to regular editing. Let's say you've recorded your voiceover and you've got like a dozen takes. Edit in that manually nightmare. But here's the shortcut. Go to tools, hit audio, then text-based editing. The AI generates a full transcript of your voiceover and then marks the pauses. From there, it's like magic. AI cuts out all the mess, trims the bad takes, and leaves you with a polished voiceover in seconds. So you just have to do a quick preview to make sure the pauses are where you want them. Honestly, for getting rid of bad takes and make sure everything flows, it's a lifesaver. Now, I can only guess how this feature works. I imagine after transcribing the text, every word gets a time code for start and finish, basically a full timeline for each sound. Then as we erase bits of it, the system just erases these bits on the timeline. And after erasing, pieces the bits together with some sort of sound blending to make everything sound natural. I rarely go that deep to see how stuff works, but this time I feel I should. Here's another feature that I'm loving, Smart Auto Beat Sync. Now, if you've ever edited a video, you know, the struggle of spending hours searching for that perfect track, it's a mood killer, right? But with Filmora, I can generate my own custom soundtrack. I just start a project, switch to the audio tab in the top menu, and hit up the AI music section. And here's where it gets fun. The AI lets me choose the mood, theme, and genre for the track. Whether you want something chill, cinematic, or even something upbeat, there are tons of options to match the vibe you are going for. After that, I choose the tempo, the length of the track, and how many songs I want to be generated. Then I just sit back for around a minute and bam, I've got unique tracks ready to go. The best part, these tracks aren't static. They change up as they play, alternating the beat and tempo so it doesn't feel flat. If I like the song, I just drag it onto the timeline and I'm good to go. Plus, since they are available for commercial use, I can drop them into any video without worrying about copyright. Total time saver and every video sounds fresh. Think of all the music you could create and how better your videos could be. The mood of the video will be decided by you, not the artists online. You will have the full control over mood at every stage of the video, allowing you to create the best narrative possible. And just the fact that you can use these generated tracks for your videos straight away is bonkers. No need to fight with permissions or copyright claims, just add them and use them. Background music is cool, but often finding the right sound effects is even more difficult. Luckily, Filmora can help you with that too and generate me sound effects in a couple of seconds. All I need to do is describe the effect and wait a few seconds. Effects can be different from forests to fallen coins. If you can describe it, Filmora can generate it. The length of these sound effects can go up to 30 seconds, so it's perfect for longer set pieces. And don't underestimate the importance of generated sound effects. If the sound effects are simple, finding the right one is easy. But at the same time, everyone is so tired of hearing the same effects time and time again. It's like Wilhelm's screen we hear in almost every action movie.
By generating your own sound effects, you will effectively stand out from the crowd in such an important way as sound. One more feature I'm using all the time is Auto Reframe Tool. It's perfect for adapting landscape videos for vertical format. I just open up the tool, upload a video, and let AI do its magic. We'll find the subject automatically and track it throughout the whole video. Works really well, and I can adjust the framing when I need it somewhere else. I see it being super useful for travel vlogs or any videos with motion. In my case, reframing is done easily. I'm always in the middle of the frame. For more dynamic videos, being able to reframe them easily without tedious re-editing is crucial. With tools like this, reusing your content for TikTok or Instagram is easier than ever. Social Video Planner. This feature lets me export videos straight to platforms like YouTube and TikTok. This way, I don't have to do it via the browser, just one less step. When doing it this way, I can tweak the video fully from picking titles and descriptions to scheduling publishing types. A great way for me to streamline the workflow. But if you think I've shown you all the AI magic in this editor, I barely scratched the surface. There's way more. Like, how about generating a title and description for your video right when you're exporting it? Yeah, you just hit a button and Filmora comes up with a bunch of catchy titles and descriptions. And the best part, they're totally copy-paste ready for YouTube. Saves me time thinking about SEO-friendly titles and descriptions. And let's not forget all the non-AI features that make this editor stand out too. For example, speed ramping. With just a couple of clicks, I can create a smooth speed ramp in any video, instantly turn an average shot into something way more dynamic, or take text animations with keyframes. I know we've seen keyframes before, but Filmora makes it so much easier and more intuitive than most editors out there. For me, having a good and reliable video editor is a must. I edit videos a lot, so being able to shave a minute here and there is golden. Honestly, Filmora is the coolest video editor I've tried this year. It's got tons of features, both the ones you expect and the ones you will be surprised by. So how many video editors have such cool AI features? And if you want to check out the AI power yourself, hit the link in the description to download it. With Filmora, you'll unlock your creative potential and start making amazing videos in no time. Thanks, Wondershare, for sponsoring this video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.